Simon says subscribe and click on the bell icon to receive notifications. Hi there everyone and welcome back to another lesson. In this video, we will be learning how we can transpose data in Excel. Transposing can be really helpful if we want the data to be changed from columns to rows or vice versa. Here is a short example how you can do that. The first thing is to select the data from the cells which you want to transpose. In this case, I'm going to select all the students' names along with the points given to them. Then I'll click on Control C for copying the data. Next, I'll go to any cell where I want the transpose table to occur. Once you click on the cell, in my case it's I13, there are two ways to transpose data. Either right click and go to the option of transpose directly from here, or the second option is to go to the option of clipboard, go click on paste, and then there's an option of transpose here. So this is completely up to you whether you want to go to the home tab and do it or do it through the shortcut. In this case, we're going to click on transpose and here you'll see all of the categories of the student's behaviors are coming vertically and all of the names of the students are coming horizontally now. You can obviously auto adjust the width of the columns yourself and the data is transposed from rows to columns and vice versa. Thanks for watching. If you're not a subscriber, click down below to subscribe so you get notified about similar videos we upload. To see the full course that this video came from, click over there. And click over there to see more videos from Simon Says It.